once again, it's TD's McGee's versus Hepe's Dominators in Turkey Bowl 2010. Because <laughs> once a year, us true athletes uh -huh. come out. True. True athletes come uh -huh. out and then showcase our talent. Uh, do you still have strength, though? No. Tads, tell me. How many how many pick sixes are you gonna throw today? So Jared, you gonna play hard today? No. Right. No, there's gonna be one pick six <laughs> out of the five picks that I throw. <laughs> oh, the man of first black. turkey bowl. Yeah, exactly. What have you heard? I'm uh, happy to be in the bigs. What's up? How you doing? Good. I nope. may not be physically strong. Nope. I may not be fast or great athlete. You're not. But you look for the intangibles in a quarterback. You have none. And leadership ability. He loves this game. So Smarts. Nope. Memory. Confidence. Nope. The know-how and the elbow grease? <laughs> nope. You've, uh, thanks. <laughs> hey, you've, uh, missed a lot of turkey bowls lately, haven't you? Only one. Uh, two, three years. Uh, <laughs> two? Three? What's the difference? Maybe four? Two years, ten years. You're here. Twenty years. Right. Hey. I have no shame. So explain some of the rules here. Is it just flags like regular football? Rules. So you can block. We don't play with rules. Oh, right. I only drew up four plays <laughs> this time around. How goes it, Ron? It goes. Oh, yeah. Sure. Unless you came here to be a bystander. I'll still outrun you. Yeah. How old are you now? Um, <laughs> a little younger than you are. <laughs> Hi, lovely ladies. Hi. Excuse. Bob Straw, how are you going to be playing? I know. What if I get my toes stepped on? I probably shouldn't be out there. Let's go. Keep it simple, stupid. All right. Right? Raise your hands. This is my combine right now. <laughs> Well, I mean, we just got to see who's here and what kind of team I can put together. Number one overall pick this year, 2010. Gerard Depardieu. No surprise here, Gerard Depardieu is the number one pick every year. I feel like hell. Two picks. Burnett. Maddie Burnett, first year playing. Tad hopes to use his height in the passing game. Crucial Sam Garns. Can't go wrong here. This guy's a three-time MVP. Bob Straw did not play. Oh God! Why would it Jimmy Geiger. Geiger, big offensive lineman, played some middle linebacker for Tad. Christian, a fixture on Hefe's Dominators, so he's won every year. Give me Arvis! You see the excitement over Arvis. He's one of Hefe's favorite players. Hefe would eventually get him because Bob Straw didn't play. Look at that power team over there. <laughs> Carwan, you can compare to a giraffe running down the field, but he makes plays. Don't be disappointed. Andrew, that was a word. Hey! <laughs> Andrew, another Turkey Bowl rookie, shows off his speed in this game. This player's a little mouthy for my taste, but he does play with heart. Ron Dixon. The savvy veteran of the Turkey Bowl, back for one more year. All three frat brothers together, Hefe, Gerard Depardieu, and the Mole. Michael, the tallest and most powerful Dixon, hopefully he can protect his brother. Heads. Heads. We'll take the ball. Let's get to the game highlights. Turkey Bowl 2010, Hefe. As all day on the first play, buying time with his feet, throw in, that's his first overall pick. That's Gerard Depardieu, and he'll pick up a big chunk of yards. Next play works just as well. Hefe looks left, finding Arvis, and that's the first score of the game. Hefe's Dominators won, TD's McGee's nothing. That score is going to change after the first play by the McGee's. Fake reverse to Andrew, buying time, escaping Neil. He'll put it up to his first overall pick. That's Matty B in the back of the end zone. And that ties the score. Dominators won, McGee's won. Ensuing drive. 
Day Park going to pick up a big gain here. Hefe having all day to throw, buying time with his feet. A third down play. It's going to be Arvis. And Arvis will pick Arvis. up a short game. They are going to go for it on fourth down. And he's going to go to his number one pick. That's Gerard Depardieu for the touchdown. Two to one, Dominators. Suing drive. TD going to try the running game. He runs left with Barnes. He runs right with Andrew. Looks like he picks up some good yards. But third down is not successful. Fumble caused by Christian. And TD's McGee's will punt. That's going to lead to a... Another touchdown by Hefe's Dominators. This one to the Giraffe, Kevin Carwana back in the end zone. Hefe now eight of nine with three touchdown passes on the first three drives. Great start to the Turkey Bowl. Tad on the other hand, a little rougher. He throws this one up for grabs. That's Jared Depardieu. He does not play for Tad's team, people. That's the first interception of the Turkey Bowl as he runs it back out. They're gonna need a defensive stop now, the McGee's do, and they start off pretty well. Getting Christian on a short run. He'll hop into that base huddle. What if we don't have money, guys? Then we will. Come get it. Well designed play, but it won't get a chance to work. Watch the man in black bust right up the middle through the offensive line. There it is, the first and only sack by TD's McGee's. That means you two inside. Inside, run in. The next guy do a slam. The other two, ten yards. Here's Tad looking for Barnes across the middle, and they're going to get a little something going on that play. That would lead to a sack by Hefe's Dominators. That would lead to a turnover on down. Still three to one, Hefe. Carwan, the big tight end, working his way off the block. He'll make a nice play. And that's gonna go for a first down. So let's not go away from that, let's do the crosses. Hefe going to try to use the running game, but Neal was stopped in the backfield. And that would lead to a turnover on downs. Here's a fourth down play. And the McGees are able to pick up a first down with Barnes. And thank goodness they could, because on this third down play, Tad just threw it up for grabs once more. This time his teammate came down with it. That's Maddie Burnett getting that jump ball off the bobble. And that cuts the deficit. It's... Hefe's Dominators three, McGee's two. A little turkey magic, why not, right? Hefe now going to find Tothers coming up the middle. That's a big play for the man with the big heart. But on third down, things will go the way of the McGee's. That's Andrew right up the middle. He'll pick it off, and he'll get stopped in the end zone. Ensuing possession, it's going to be more of the Andrew show. You see the show on the sideline. Well designed play, roll out. Uh, we ran it a couple times before, once with success, one without success. Uh, Andrew just made a really good move and broke to the end zone. <laughs> Feel about that? That was awesome. That's great. Andrew gonna show up again on the next possession with his second pick of the game in the end zone. The McGee's have the ball back. Keep going, keep going. Oh yeah. TD going to get sacked by Hefe. Looking again, throwing nice across run. the middle to Ron. That was fourth down, but that comes up short. Next possession. Tad throws it up again, and Depardieu is there. Again, looks like a repeat of the first interception. Hefe looking. Nice, solid throw to Depardieu. And on the next play, he'll reward Gerard Depardieu with his second touchdown of the game. That puts the Dominators up 4-3. Hefe again on the next drive. Carwan running into the big belly of Geiger. Carwan on a quick out. And on fourth down, he's going to look for Gerard Depardieu in the end zone. 
Oh, right through his mitts. Nice ball, buddy. McGee, that you're my receiver tomorrow. I'm in trouble. Still 4-3 Dominators. Tad looking, throwing. That's tipped off yeah. Geiger's hand into Matt Burnett's hand. Again looking, but Neil, the doctor with the sack. The beast. That gives Hefe the ball back, and he's going to take off running on first down, and the fleet-footed Hefe runs for a touchdown. Mm -hmm. Exactly. How about that play? Off the hands of the defender. Quarterback completes the ball to himself. Now things are getting Yep. Still 5-3 Hefe. Tad throws it up, and Barnes in the corner of the end zone called for flag guarding. That would come up very important because on the very next play, Arvis makes the play of the game. Son of a... Looking for a block from Hefe. Gets it. Cuts back inside. Arvis showing rare speed, trying to slow down, but the pursuit's still happening. And that is from one end zone to the other. Six to three dominators. Play of the game by Arvis. Very next play. Another interception. That's Tad's fourth. This one by Tuthers. F.A. looking to add on the lead. Throw into Jared. This next play, we had to keep in because Ron... The last man tackling in the flag football game. Rona, you are the greatest. He'll make you not want to catch the ball. Now Brina's very last play of the game. Throws it up. Off Ron's hands into Andrews. They're going to get a touchdown on that, making the final score 6-4. to four. There's no I in team, but there is an I in win. Yeah. Yeah. That's right, that's right. I'm your team, Andrew. This is the greatest game of the year because this is the only game of the year. <laughs> <laughs>